in our offices. The thinking here that the best ideas come from face-to-face -face conversations with your coworkers. But working moms and other Yahoo employees may think the switch to a cubicle from the comforts of home has little impact on their creativity and a great big impact on their attempts at uh, a work-life balance. So the talkback question today is Yahoo wrong to end telecommuting? And I want to bring in Professor Gay Teresa Johnson and her husband Chuck D. They're going to be talking about the Trayvon Martin segment after a break. But I wanted to bring you in, Gay, because you have a, you have a baby, a one-year-old. And telecommuting is probably pretty important to you. So do you think Yahoo is right to end telecommuting? No, I, I, I don't think they're right at all. It's interesting because nowadays with this advent of new media, I mean, you have a, a whole different kind of set of social questions. So, I mean, is it better for women to be in an office side by side with their other core workers? Probably it's great in terms of interpersonal relations, and it's probably better for women to be uh, in, in the office next to their core workers in terms of interpersonal relations. But in terms of, of, of not being able to telecommute when you have a child, that's something that I think really privileges men because women, uh, uh, heterosexual women don't have have wives uh, at home to to help them with those children uh, do you agree with that Amy no, well look I think the reason we're talking about this is because it's an internet company it's a technology company and you certainly wouldn't expect this from a technology company but look you know they're a they're a private business the government's not involved so it's not law if it doesn't work they can change it back but you know I think through social media and technology, we have lost some of those interpersonal relationships and relationship building skills. And it sparks creativity when you're with your coworkers, and that's why companies do retreats and, and team building exercises and whatnot. So they may think that it's what's best for them right now. If it doesn't work, they can change it back, but I'm not really one to decide. <laughs> well, well, Ross, mm -hmm. I, I think that there are reports out there that some Yahoo employees were abusing the privilege and they weren't working as hard as one might expect from home, and that's mm -hmm. really why mm -hmm. the Yahoo boss called them back into the physical workspace. Right, and I, and I mean, look, these kind of decisions obviously do have to vary from company to company, and, you know, there are undoubtedly situations in which you end up with sort of telecommuting as a license to sort of slack off and so on. With that being said, I mean, personally, I'm a big fan of telecommuting. I think it's one of the great gifts that technology offers to working mothers, working fathers, <laughs> working people of all kinds. And I also think Yahoo is you know, they're a company that's having a difficult time and have had a difficult time for a while figuring out their identity in the marketplace. They're sort of a legacy brand from the first wave of internet companies that has a big, you know, a, a lot of resources because of that, but doesn't know exactly what they're doing in the digital space right now. And this sort of seems like the kind of shake things up move that um, a CEO or COO tends to make when they don't know exactly what they're doing overall. Uh -oh. So that would be the, that would be the eyebrow I'd well, raise if I were a Yahoo <laughs> stockholder, I guess. Uh, Chuck D, you want to say would something? Also count yeah. yeah, because I, in my business, a virtual studio, if you had the same philosophy in tune, um, you could be in three or four different parts of the country and actually get the job done. So it depends on your productivity. At the end of the day, your philosophy got to be intact. But as far as a Yahoo CEO, that business is so expansive that it might be necessary to get everybody in the room to look at e each other because they cover a lot of ground. And my business is really simple. Let's do this, come together, think about this, and you could be in three or four different places across the world. So telecommunications is great. It's the great. virtual well, office and the virtual hat is all about oh, what it's yeah. all about. I and, dig it. And Jason, I you're a professor. You. Jason, you're a professor. You teach mm -hmm. young people, and young people might be listening to this Yahoo decision and saying, what is up with that? Because this, that's yeah. not the way the world is going. It, no, it's not. And I know Yahoo wants to take themselves back to the day when they were popular, but we don't need to go back to like 1997, okay, before people could telecommute. This doesn't make any sense. First and foremost, there's an economic issue. This is going to disrupt a lot of employees' ability to get child care. They have to completely change how their families are functioning. And by the way, gas is sometimes $5 a gallon in California. People have to start commuting again. I think there's an economic impact to this decision that doesn't make any sense. And the reason the reason that Yahoo has been burning through CEOs, you know, three or four of them over the last two or three years is because everyone tries to come in and radically change the culture around and not pay attention to the employees they have. This is a bad idea and in six months they're going to have to go back on it. Okay. Uh, more than 25% yeah. of our workforce perform their daily jobs telecommuting. This is a bad idea by Yahoo and I like Yahoo. 
I would hope that uh, once that people see each other face to face, exchange gifts, whatever, uh, give each other a hug, that we go back to these uh, this policy. Look, uh, have you been on the road lately? I mean, to get up in the morning and, and get on the highway these days and spend an hour and a half stuck in traffic. Right. I think telecommunica telecommunication is a great idea, and I hope more companies look forward to it. Okay, so what are our what are our friends out there saying about this? Is Yahoo wrong to end telecommuting? This from Marquis. This is a fatal mistake.